connection. Well, oh. Please reveal yourself. Oh, awkward. Oh, there he is. Father and firefighter Patrick McBride from Liverpool, who is soon going to be delivering chocolates in his spare time. <laughs> very good morning to you. Good morning. Oh, that's very kind. Cool. Uh, are they for beers? Yeah, thanks, mate. Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you, by the way. I like the chocolate. Thank you very much indeed. Come and, come and have a seat. Um, so wh what does it take then to be the, the man who inherits this incredible legacy? Yeah, um, it is an iconic, iconic advertising campaign and, and figure in front of everyone. So I think it's this milk train man is, is it's about being thoughtful. So, you know, I think. Oh, is that what it is? Is it, it about is, being thoughtful? Yes, it's about being thoughtful. Okay. Although we do keep the sort of, you know, the daring edge to it and the, you know, the the heroic feats that, that I'm, that I'm going to go to. But do women really want to be stuffed with chocolates anymore? Is that is that thoughtful? Or is it basically flying in the face of... Of the whole sugar-free thing? Yes. Mm. I wonder if it's... Has the milk train man had his time? Should he be bringing them kale? Kale biscuits? Kale crisps? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Here are you, here's your box of kale crisps. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Rather than, here's a box of fattening chocolates. Oh, thanks, buddy. Do you know what? I you think, know? I think... Uh, oh, I'm throwing it out there. It's a devil's advocate. Yeah. I don't know. No, that's fine. And do you know what? On occasion, I think it's nice to be uh, appreciated and it's nice to be, you know, shown gestures. I mean, the milk train man is about the smaller gestures that go behind the gift of giving and in this case it is a case of you are you know, actually this romantic in real life um i would well my wife would say 70 80 percent of the time i think when you know. did you last oh. buy your wife chocolates um actually buy them okay i will actually buy them i was going to say because i will check with her <laughs> you can check that's okay <laughs> when did you last buy your wife chocolate um christmas time maybe and did you buy a milk tray um, I bought uh, something along that line. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't buy a milk tray, did you? Oh, <laughs> now you're a firefighter in yes, your um, firefighter. daily job, so yeah. I mean, you kind of have a heroic air about you anyway, don't be, you? Yeah. Um, it, you know, pretty tough job. Yeah, it can be. It can be. I mean, it's not. You know, thankfully, you know, the, the stuff that we do now with regards to fire safety and stuff like that, I mean, just just generally, um, and a lot of prevention, fire prevention. That I mean, the heroic sort of house fires and stuff like that thankfully don't aren't as as, as frequent as what they you yeah. know they were in is the past is your wife ready for the millions of women in this country to start <laughs> screaming and well she trying did. to tear your clothes off she did suggest that i go in for it so <laughs> oh, was she the one who put you up to it yeah she did yeah she did she um she heard it on a radio broadcast came home and just suggested that I um, that I applied. And how many other people had applied for the role? Yeah, there was twenty thousand people that applied. Wow. Really? Yeah. Who so. had to decide who was the most milk tray man out of all of that number of I people? Did, yeah, well, look know. at him. He looks <laughs> central <laughs> casting milk tray. <laughs> I think, like I say, because there was a lot of there was a lot of uh, like women that applied for the milk tray role as well. Well, good um, for them. So you know, it was a, it was more about the message behind it. You kind of a milk tray woman. I, Why uh, on earth? Not. Well, I, I was, I was just about to say. A load of black gear giving me chocolates. I was just about to say. Sorry, and what's about that is not possible as a woman. Because eventually, equality has to have some kind of limitation. The milk tray man, by definition of its title, is for a man. If Celia put a lovely black she and sailed down and then gave me some chocolate. I do not want her going down with a big rope and giving me chocolates. Don't you? You? I wouldn't mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so wrong. Anyway, it's so lovely to see yeah, you. you. Um, how much of it is about the polar nature? I mean, if you're just wearing your normal clothes, do you think it would still work? Um, no. I think I think it's. it's I bet in your fireman gear, you get more action, eh? Well, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> if, I can, you know if I can combine the two. It's absolutely lovely to see you. Oh, thank thank you, you so much. Good to see you. Mate. Don't you think at this point I should 